It's been so much to me because this has been a long time coming. I've gone all my other years of high school not even coming to state. And then I finally get there and I decide, you know, why not just make some noise here? So this is your first time at state? Ever. So where did you finish? I mean, were you just out of reach at just regionals reach. or? Lost in the semis on the Constellation side. So how heartbreaking is that to go three years and not even get to taste this? Very heartbreaking. I can't. I don't know how I let myself do it. I just, I can't understand. I don't know. Did you think about quitting? No, oh, all the time. Did I feel, I feel as a wrestler, you always have thoughts of quitting because practices are just so rough and it just always seems like it's not putting it. Your effort isn't getting fully like repaid in the matches and stuff. So of course, all the time. So this year, what what drove you? I mean, I mean, to come out senior year, I mean, you could have been chilling this year. Yeah, but. I feel like I've seen a lot of people come through my school who either should have been placers or should have been even multiple time state champs and it's never happened and I kind of felt like I just took on all their energy and just brought it into this tournament with everything I have. Tell me about that match. I mean that goes to, I mean, into overtime. Tell me about winning that. How, what you did. That was the greatest feeling ever. I think I jumped up just slapped my hands together. but. I f he he fought very hard and it was a great match going all the way through. And I'm exhausted, but I'm just happy I made it through on top. Oh man, it was you know down to the wire. One of those deals where I kind of felt like he should take top at the end. He wrote him out, but then it's he's a senior. This is his match, his choice. He said he'd get out. He got out. <laughs> it's amazing. Tell me about the last three years for him, with him never getting to the wow. state tournament. Not only that, but he had one 500 record. He was. 17 and 17 last year. He was, uh, you know, losing records the previous two years. He, uh, you know, he's always had potential. We've always seen it. He just never really worked hard. He's never really applied himself. This year he came back and I think he got his stuff together. He was uh, stud on the football field this year. He set the school sack record, you know, as a defensive end at 160 pounds, you know, and, you know, they love him there and he's earned it. Tell me about just. You know, he said that he thought many times about quitting. How impressive is it for a kid to come out after three years of not getting the state and then coming out and now he's in the championship? Yeah, you know, losing is, is tough in anything, but wrestling is about as tough as it gets. And he, uh, I'm sure he saw some of his teammates succeed and, you know, it's tough. And, you know, just to, to go from that low to this high, you don't see that very often. And honestly, I don't know of another kid that's, that's done it. it